guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm filming for you my baby must-haves or my baby essentials for a baby that is three months to six months old. My son Jackson is nearly six months old and these are all the products that we have been using the most over the past three months. I thought I'd film this because my newborn essentials video was so, so popular. So I will link that down below. If you have a younger baby, definitely go and check that out. Obviously at this age, a baby is playing more, they're able to do more. So I have so many products to show you. So I'm gonna just quickly run through them. I know you're a mum. I know you haven't got much time to watch this kind of thing. If you have any other questions, please comment below. I always reply to my comments. And I will make sure that I link all of these products in the description down below if you want to go and have a look at them or find out more about them, the links are down below. So to start out, I'm going to talk you through all of the products that Jackson has been loving in terms of entertainment. So the first thing that I have been going on about for the past three months is his Jumperoo. Now I am not sponsored by these people at all. He just loves this toy so much. He will happily sit in it in the kitchen while I make breakfast, lunch, dinner, while I do things. He loves to sit in it and play. He actually loves this product so much that we have got a second activity center to have upstairs now so that while while I'm getting dressed or putting on my makeup, he can sit happily in that and play with all of the toys around it. I know it may seem a little bit excessive to have a second activity center upstairs, but it just makes my life so much easier because he was definitely getting fed up of just laying on his back with toys on my bed while I got dressed. Obviously to go in a toy like this, your baby has to have quite good head control and neck control. And I don't really put him in this for longer than 10 to 15 minutes because he is still quite young. If your baby isn't ready for this, my son has also really loved having a play mat. We have had this same one for all of our boys and I really like it because you can add as many toys onto it as you want. There's music on it, there's a mirror that he loves and he will happily play on it, either having tummy time or on his back. Jackson also quite likes sitting up in this really bright colorful ring that we got on Amazon. Both of my boys played with it before and it's great to help him learn how to sit up. He can also just lay in there with some toys and he quite likes to look at all of the bright colors around. Jackson still loves his cot mobile as well. This one is from Mamas and Papas. We just got it really because it goes to the decor. Quite enjoys the music and just watching it go around while I choose his clothes for the day. Jackson still also loves the Lamar's toys. They're so bright, they're so colorful. This one's got a mirror and makes music as well. I've also added some Lamar's toys to his playmat as well because he really does seem to favor them. They're really bright, they're really colorful. They have like scrunchy bits on them. And he is also now getting into books. <laughs> he really likes when I read him books now. We love these That's Not My books because they have like some texture on them and they're quite simple for him to like look at the pages as well. He also likes books that make sounds or have sound buttons on them or have lots of textures and bright colors. This wedge has been really really great. I found it on Amazon and I bought it because I felt like Jackson hated being in his flat carry cot of the buggy um, but he wasn't quite ready to go in the sat up part of his buggy either so I looked for this buggy wedge. It fits really well in our buggy and I don't only use it for the buggy I also sometimes use it on the play mat um, because he doesn't like being really flat. I personally think he's got maybe a little bit of reflux so he likes to be a little bit more sat up or he's just being nosy and looking around but we have loved it we use it all the time we lost it momentarily on holiday because we would even use it when he was laying on a sun lounger to lay him on and we both panicked we were like where's the wedge where's the wedge gone we need the wedge yeah, so we have really loved it if you have a nosy baby this might keep them going in the carry cot part of the buggy for a bit longer we also just got this car mirror for Jackson so it goes on the seat in front of him so when I'm stopping at a traffic light, I can quickly look back in the rear view mirror and see that he is happy or asleep or what he's doing. It just personally gives me a little bit of peace of mind that I can kind of check on him. And now with babies having to be in rear facing car seats for so much longer, I just thought it was worth mentioning this product. Speaking of car, he is still in his Duna car seat and I still absolutely love it. I've done a really in-depth review on this car seat, so I will link that down below. It's brilliant. It has wheels that stay attached to it at all times. Especially for me as a mum of three, I find it so easy that when I do the school run, I don't have to open the boot. The wheels are just ready to go. You just click them down and off you go. And I still love it, so I had to mention it again. We also still really love our Angel Care monitor. This is a baby monitor that has video and it has 
sound, but it also measures your baby's breathing. This really gives you peace of mind because Jackson sleeps on his front. If he didn't breathe or move or anything for 20 seconds, an alarm would go off. I just really love having it and knowing that he is breathing and that he is safe and well. It just gives me peace of mind. I am quite an anxious mother. So if you are, you might also love this monitor. Jackson has just woken up from his nap early, so he's gonna help me out with the rest of the video. So another thing I wanted to mention was his changing mats. We get the changing mats with really high sides. We got one on John Lewis and one from Amazon, and I love having them. Obviously, I would never leave him on a changing mat, but it gives me a little bit of peace of mind because he can roll now. They are so, so quick, so you have to be so careful. Yeah. I also thought I would mention his baby grows. We get the majority of his baby grows from Next, and they just wash up really well. There's great designs, so I wanted to show you those as well. I've got two bath supports to show you. He still loves this one that you just lay on, and it is a really thin material, and I love having this because you don't need a separate baby bath. You can just stick it in the bath and drain the water as you normally would. But now that he's getting older, we have got this second bath support that he can sit up in, and he absolutely loves it. It's so nice that he can sit with his brothers and play with the water. He doesn't have a long bath so he sits in this quite well. As they're getting closer to six months I would definitely recommend a bath support like this because it just goes in the bath and you can drain the water easily and it was really cheap. Next up I have some teething products to show you. I don't know about your baby but he has been teething so much over the last three months. We have absolutely loved him using bandana bibs. They are basically just a triangle. You can get them at most places and I like them because they go right under the chin. They catch all of the dribble. He also loves this teething toy. It's called Zolly. I got it on Amazon. It's really easy for him to hold. It is really gummy. It is really ridged and he chews on it for ages. It's a great one to give him when he's sat in the car seat. So I wanted to show you that. Right, we also had to mention his Sophie the Giraffe. He absolutely loves it. He can grip onto it really well. It's a really good like rubbery texture for him to hold and to just chew on when he's teething. So I definitely recommend that. Really hoping that you can see this, but a viewer actually sent me a bunch of teething jewelry and it's so clever. I never had this with my other children. I will put the links down below. This one is in lovely spring colors. It's quite stylish and you can actually just wear it and then your baby can eat your necklace, play with it, no problem. They're rubbery, they can chew on them. I even got a teething bangle so that he can eat my bangle if we're just out sat somewhere. They come in all kinds of different like shapes and styles. Here is another just gray one. And I've been finding myself using them a lot. Jackson loves chewing on them. And I just think they're such a clever product. Right, then I also wanted to talk you through a few weaning products that we have been loving. We have weaned Jackson slightly early at five months rather than six months, but so many people have asked me what high chair we use. We have the Ickle Bubba high chair, which I love. It's really comfortable. The seat is like memory foam and it's quite stylish. I really love it. We have also always loved our IKEA high chair. It is super cheap, so easy to use, so easy to clean. You can take the legs off and take it away with you or to someone's house if you needed to. So we also have loved that. We also recently found this product. These are little pouches that you can stick your own homemade baby food into. There is a Ziploc on the bottom and then you can take them out for ease. They're so convenient. They're as convenient as store-bought pouches, but you can make the food yourself. So I definitely wanted to mention those. And then finally, I just wanted to mention what medication we've had for Jackson. I've had that question a few times and he has definitely been getting more colds, especially from his brothers bringing germs home. So we always have these things in our cupboards. We always have Calpol. We always have saline drops if he has a blocked nose because if your baby has a blocked nose, it's really hard for them to feed. So these have been fabulous. He also really loves teeth powder when his teeth really hurt. They really calm him down. Also been using liquid ambisol, which numbs the area that it hurts on his gums. So that has also really been helping with any teething pain. Yes, but that is it for this video. I really hope you liked it. Please give it a big thumbs up if you did, and I will definitely film a six to nine month baby must haves if it's something that you wanna see. Don't forget to subscribe for more videos. I post Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays at 7 p.m. And I will see you very soon. Bye.